OK, so here what we have is now what is an imaginary number. So we talked about imaginary unit, a complex number. Now we're going to be dealing with you know, what exactly is an imaginary number. So we have an imaginary unit. All right, and we know that the imaginary unit we represent with i, which equals the square root of negative 1. And then we set a complex number. This is in the form of a plus bi, where a and b are both going to be real numbers. Now, an imaginary number is going to be a complex number, but it's going to be a complex number where when, when a equals 0. All right? So therefore, that can come into any, any port. We could have uh, 7i is an imaginary number, negative 3i is an imaginary number, and just just our, uh, our, just our unit i, that's also just what we call an imaginary number because our a in the form of our complex number is going to be equal to 0. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is what you have for an imaginary number. Thanks.